Hello world, I'm Dedalian, and welcome back to Minecraft Dungeons. Now, I want to complete, my plan is, I, uh, today I actually want to complete Underhauls, where I keep stuttering. And then in a future episode, maybe I'll do Obsidian Pinnacle. As of the time I'm recording this, it is the day before August. And on August 8th, on August 8th, Creeping Winter is coming out. I've seen a lot of cool new stuff that's going to be coming out. Apparently, wait, how do I get back to the main island? Here we go. So I'm going to just jump straight into Underhauls, but I've seen a lot of new in, 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 uh, and interesting stuff that's apparently going to be coming out, such as like a bunch of new merchants and some daily quests looking thing, thingamajig. I'm not really sure what's happening there. Before I go on, let me actually make sure I do have everything that I want equipped actually equipped, because I feel like this is something that I don't actually take care of enough to check usually okay so looks like everything's fine let me check my map no secrets just one chest that's fine whatever i still want to do this dungeon just for the sake of doing this dungeon i'm not sure oh die oh i forgot i had snowball right i have this solar robe now oh this snowball is so helpful snow snowball is probably my favorite enchantment even though pr to be honest since i am going for, for a full soul build i think i would prefer something soul based i'm not sure i don't i i really like soul uh soul build just because of this what's it what's it called the steam jiggy the soul healer oh there's a enchanter up here but yeah so what i what, what my plan is is actually tomorrow i am uh i have i am starting university courses again however because of the covid 19 pandemic all of my courses will be online Apparently, not all courses will be online, which kind of surprised me. I thought uh, the decision by my university was that all courses were going to be online. But to be honest, I'm not really sure how that's going to turn out. Because, to be honest, from my perspective, I feel like you need... Okay, that's not good. I see those flames. You really... For, 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 for science labs, you really need to be there. Like, how can you do a science lab through a computer. I'm not sure. Right. Or, or, or science, like thankfully I'm, I'm a computer science major, philosophy minor. So any science labs I actually have are not actual science labs. They're just like programming assignments, which I don't know. I don't know why, I don't know why computer science labs are called, even called labs. They're not really labs. We're not tinkering around with it. We're not tinkering around with like, instruments or anything i don't know wait is this the only way i see a path that back here let me just check back here just in case oh there is nothing back here great okay yeah so what else has been going on um oh right so i was talking about the covid19 pandemic that for that reason my courses will be uh, online which is great means i don't have to commute all the way to school which generally takes up like a lot of my a lot of time um uh, like where where I use where I live and the time and where my university is like I have to drive there. Uh, no, I don't drive to the university. How do I describe this? I drive. Oh, I I, I guess technically I kind of drive to the university, but not really. So my university has like two campuses, right? Like a north campus and a south campus. And there is this light rail train that runs between the south campus and the north campus. And I park in at south campus, but all of my courses, all of my lectures and labs are hosted. Oh, Jesus Christ. Let me focus on this. Um, let me focus on these enchanted raids first, actually. I don't want to talk and then just end up dying because I'm not paying attention. Because I'm pretty sure I mentioned before, and I'm pretty sure... Most of you guys who watch my videos are sick of me hearing it, uh, are sick of me saying this, but I am very bad at multitasking, so I'm either focusing on the game, or I'm letting my brain just run on autopilot while I talk. So, uh, what are we even supposed to do here? We're supposed to find some sort of key or something. Right, now I remember. Ah, uh, well, let me just go in here and do an explosion real quick, because I have the uh, souls for it. But yeah, wait, what was I saying? I already forgot. Um, oh, right, right, so, 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 I park at the South Campus, then I take the LR, going, traveling to South Campus in the morning, generally there's traffic, like, like, I, 
I used to like to take courses like in the app that were only in the afternoon and in the evening, but to be honest, I don't know. I feel like that's not really. I just use that as an excuse to sleep in, and then I waste a lot of the day. So, re so relatively recently, I've been taking liking the idea of taking courses that are in the morning or in the afternoon. So, so like I'll take as many courses. I take uh, some courses in the morning. Go grab lunch at the university, and then go for go for. Oh, another soul rope, but it's worse than my soul rope. Uh, let me actually check the enchants, but yeah. Shoot, what am I gonna say? What am I even trying to say? Swift footed. Uh, and I just kind of realized I kind of gotta go use the washroom, but I'm too busy recording, so whatever. I'll use the washroom after this. Too much information? Maybe. Whatever. Right, so. Yeah, now, now when I go to the university, like, there's always traffic there, because I go in the morning. Or I, um. And then what happens? Oh, I found I found the key. Great. So I go in the morning, and then what? Uh, right, right. So there's usually traffic. So maybe it'll take me like I don't know. Actually, how long does it take me? I don't even remember how long it takes me to travel to the UFA. I'm just. It, it, it may it take it might take me something like maybe a, I don't know. Twenty minutes, half hour. Shoot, I don't actually remember. I might have to ask my girlfriend, but she's at work right now, so. Yeah. Uh, okay, so, and then, yeah, I got a, t I got a park, and then I got to, like, go to the, uh, this light rail train, and then I got to, and then I go to North Campus, and then I got to walk to my courses, and all, and then, and then, like, when I go back home, like, that's a whole nother, that's a whole other ordeal. Um, depending on when I leave, uh, the university to travel back home, uh, the journey back home could either be shorter, or it could be significantly longer. It depends on whether I leave during rush hour. Because this, yeah, there's like this time again where everyone just leaves work. And if I get caught up in that, then oh boy. <laughs> I'm just sitting in traffic. Uh, not very fun. Yeah. So let me just check back here. Because, I don't know, could, there could be something back here, you know. Just in case. Might want to check. Okay, there is nothing back here. Well, great. So, what do I want to do now? Okay, so, yeah, I don't know. I think what I was saying, though, was, like, all of my courses, again, are this time going to be online, which is great for me, because I don't have to deal with the whole hassle of driving to the university and coming back. I mean, yeah, it works for me. Okay, let me go here. Let me check if there's anything back here. There is nothing back here. I don't know if there's any courses. I, I feel I've enrolled for some courses, but I don't know if there are any courses. Oh, what? There's a skeleton back here. I didn't even notice. I don't know if there are any courses I enrolled this semester that are actually all that interesting to me. I mean, I'm taking one course that's like on machine learning. I am dumb! Hey, everyone, can you see what's wrong with this? I forgot the freaking key! Oh my god! Holy Christ, am I dumb. Okay, you know what? Now that I think of it, now that I think of about it, this actually happens to me quite often. So you know what? We're just going to have to suck this up. I think the key's somewhere around here. And my guess was right. Great. Okay, so now I got to walk all the way back and then unlock that door. And I think there's still another floor, like another area to explore after I unlock this door. So we will do that. Yeah. I something else I really want to do is so uh, my Aki bow. Uh, I think in a previous video I mentioned that uh, I wanted to uh, learn archery, and I had my eyes on the Aki bow, which is this uh, kind of uh, training bow that can be safely dry fired, and you can just kind of practice at home. And it also you, there's like a mobile app for it, so you can like download the mobile app, attach it to the Acubo, and then like do some virtual archery. And I finally got it, and I, I don't know if I should be surprised or not, but shooting a bow is not exactly how I envisioned it, and not in a bad way. It just it just wasn't. It was just tougher than I thought it would be. Like I feel like my form is not too bad. 
though I probably should um, down I probably should ask like make some form check videos and ask people to check for me for now though give me a minute because I actually want to focus on this because I feel like if I don't focus on this I'm actually gonna die come on just die for me already why do you guys live why do you guys exist hmm? you guys exist just to make my life full of suffering get out of here skedaddle Okay, I don't want to go this way because this is oh my freaking god. Oh my freaking god. That's lightning fast uh, Oh my god, this is not good. This is not good No, no, no Come on come on come on. Oh Get wrecked. Oh my god this I this iron head amulet actually saved my ass. Holy Christ I took so much damage there and then the I, I act I didn't even mean to use the iron hide amulet. I act I accidentally used it. That was kinda bad. But you know what? Whatever. We're still living. We're still living. Okay. This place looks like a place where I would get ambushed. No? Oh, okay. I mean I mean if I'm not gonna get ambushed, I'll take it. Wait, this is the this is is this the exit? I don't wanna go to the exit. I wanna explore this whole area. Is that the exit? I actually can't tell. I, I, I don't know. You know what? We'll, we'll just ignore it for now. Let me explore all this other area. Because even if there are any chests, I still want the XP. Oh, apple. Thank you very much. Oh, that reminds me. I have a whole bunch of apples here in the kitchen. Um, I better cut them because we've they've just been kind of sitting here for a while now. I don't know. Yeah, but like for one. Okay, first of all. When it comes to shooting a bow, I am a weak, weak boy. Like, holy Christ, I have no muscle. Um, I set the AccuBow to um, the, a draw weight of like, like 15, 20 pounds or something. And oh my god, were my arms shaking. Like, it's, it, it is not that easy. Um, after, after just about three days of just kind of like playing around with it though, I feel like my arms are shaking a little bit less. So today I actually decided to take the draw weight and bump it up to um, about 25. And you know what, I, can, I seem to be able to handle it, so that's great. Um, one of the things I, one of the things why, one of the reasons, what am I saying? One of the reasons why I did want to learn archery was not just because it sounds kind of cool, to me at least, and, but also because historically, especially when I was a teenager, I was kind of that teenage kid who always like slouched like 24 seven and like my posture was really bad. And my mother would always tell me like, Oh, Oliver, you need to like straighten out your back, work on those back muscles. And I was just like, ah, screw it. I don't want to exercise. And then only in university did I pick up like an actual sport, like table tennis. And oh my God, that's a lot of monsters. And then apparently my mother commented how after I started playing table tennis, my posture became a lot better. And so I was just thinking back to what my mother told me about how, like, oh, you know, if you, if you work those back muscles, your posture can become a little better. And I mean, apparently a misconception I do hear with archery is that, oh, you know, when you pull the, when you pull the bow back, you're using your arm muscles. But apparently that's a misconception. The correct technique, I mean, you can pull with your arm muscles, but well, that's not considered good technique. Good technique uh, uh, is considered using your back muscles. You just like squeeze your back, mu back muscles, I guess, together, and then that helps you draw your arms apart, and that's how you draw the bow apart. And so yeah, that's kind of what I've been doing, and I find that it works pretty well for me, uh, as I guess it should. Otherwise, I don't know why people would call it good, good technique. But yeah. Wait, let me check over here. No, there's nothing over here. What am I doing? Okay, well, now I've got to do this walk all the way back. In a past video, uh, in the in, a, in one of the, I think in the, actually, oh my god, I always keep stuttering. What am I trying to say? So, in the previous Minecraft Dungeons video, I actually I accidentally muted myself. Wait, which way am I going? No, no, I need to go this way. I accidentally I accidentally muted myself, and, uh. I, I, I ended up like creating commentary to, like a uh, com uh, additional commentary to just kind of voice over the video to lay uh, lay over the video 
But in the original video, what I had done was I had planned. There was a there was a part of the video where I was just kind of walking and I wasn't really battling any monsters. And during that part, I actually wanted to cut out that part um, because you know I'm not battling any monsters. So I made sure to stay silent uh, in my commentary. And yeah, I don't know. Uh, I and so that I could like cut that out, cut out that part really easy. And because I ended up uh, doing like some sort of overlay commentary in the end because my microphone was muted, I ended up not doing that. But to be honest, I don't know. I feel like should should I should I look for parts of the video to cut out, or should I just like talk over, just continue talking and finding something to talk about, even when I'm just walking around and doing nothing just to like make the video, keep the video at least a little bit entertaining. I don't know. Wait, what? How did I go through here? Oh, there we go, Lever. I think this is it actually. This dungeon was not as long as I thought. Wait, what? There's a whole area over, he over here. How do I get over here? What? Uh, okay. I mean, I guess I can't go over there. I don't see anything that would allow me to go over there. What? Oh, interesting. I've never, I don't think I've ever seen this wall before. Oh, well, well, we can, we can just go out. Okay, let me just throw this TNT. I don't want to blow myself up, so I'm just going to stand here. Nice. Okay, so, before I continue on, one thing that I would like to do is take a look at some of the armors that I got. So, I got another, I got a level power 30 soul rope. Uh, I got speed synergy, no thank you, burning, surprise gift, no thank you, so on, and health synergy. I'll pass. Thank you very much. What about the soul robe? Ooh, soul speed, but I don't know. Le power 36 soul robe or power 32 soul robe? Do I really want to downgrade? Uh, I don't know. I think I'll salvage this. Wait, why do I have this Grim Armor then either? Because this thing is uh, th um, power 36. Let me just salvage this Grim Armor as well. Okay, so this power ball I can salvage, this power ball I can salvage, this b cr rapid crossbow I'm gonna equip to raise my power, and then what else? I can salvage this, these great hammers, because I don't like great hammers, nor do I like this mace. I will equip this. Uh, I will equip this, so what's it called, Cutlass, to raise my power. And then what about my artifacts? I got this power 33. I got this power 30. Do I have anything that's above power 30? Yes, I do. Do I have anything else that's above power 30? Yes, I do. Do I have anything else that's above power 33? The answer to that would be no. Okay, so let's go through. Great. Beautiful. Yeah. I think I went on a bit big ramp, but yeah, what I wanted to say at the very beginning, I think somewhere along the lines of was like, yeah, Minecraft Dungeons is coming out on uh, August 8th. So that's about uh, eight days away, I guess, eight, nine days away. So I kind of want to complete the uh, Obsidian Pinnacle, defeat the Horde of Ender before that comes. So that will be my goal. And also, I'm quite short, of em I'm quite short on Emerald. I've got two Firework Rockets now. I don't really need both of these, so I'll just salvage this one. And then let me quickly re-equip everything that I have, since I'm not going to be... Why did I... Wait, wait a minute. I only have 500 emeralds. Why did I try to raise my power? Because that I, I should only raise my power only if I'm actually going to be buying stuff. But to be honest, with this little emerald, I'd rather not buy stuff. I feel kind of dumb. Whatever. I think this video has been long enough. So, with that being said, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please leave a like, and please subscribe. And, with that being said, farewell.